So I'm in the hotel room. It's awesome. I think it'll work. Tonight was a really good night. It's a really good fucking show. Really good fucking show. Um, great seats. Well, seat. I mean, I had one seat. I'm just saying. Felt really bad because there was this really short, tiny Asian girl that had the seat right behind me. And as I walked back to my seat, you know, from going to get a water, I just passed by her and I said, I'm really sorry. <laughs> and she was like, what are you sorry for? And then I stood right in front of her with my fucking top hat on. Like, I was like, lurch status. God, it's so fucked up. But I mean, hey, I just, I, you know, situations like that I can't do anything about. When I'm in GA and I see a short person or, you know, like I I have them be in front or I go behind, you know, but it's, I can't. So, anyhow. So, yeah, so the show was really awesome and it took a while to get out of there and then to get downtown to go meet with Dawn. <laughs> And we walked around uh, downtown the gas lamp district. It was really funny because, um, you know, most of my experience with the gas lamp district has to do with during Comic-Con times. You know, it's walking from hotels and back or it's just fucking being down there, you know, and just hanging out. And during Comic-Con weekend, a lot of the bars will have... Um, I don't know, I mean, like, it's not that they're completely different than what they are normally, but a lot of them will cater to whatever the fuck is going to bring, like, the most people in. So, there was a couple places that uh, I wanted to check out on a non-Comic-Con weekend. You know, there was a couple of the Irish bars, and then uh, this place called the Tipsy Crow. Uh, well, we went back to the Tipsy Crow, and it was just the same in terms of... Uh, shitty well it's not fair to say shitty music and forget what they were playing but it was shitty so therefore you know we were there and we're just like what the fuck i don't know i don't know what do you like this no i don't like this let's go upstairs upstairs the same bullshit except for way more packed uh i don't know i just always got the impression from you know just the one or two people i'd see standing outside of there that it was more of like a not quite an indie place but like kind of like hey you like beer i like beer let's do this let's beer you know not like fucking the Magic Mountain Aqua Girl theme. Not even putting together songs here. I'm just spouting off different terrible adjectives that have to do with weird songs. Anyhow. So we walked around a bit and it was awesome. You know. And then Dawn lost her car. <laughs> she thought she parked on like one of the like parallel streets but she had to really parked on one of the you know vertical streets or horizontal whatever so we found her car <coughs> and um caught me to mine i had to pee so bad but uh anyhow so it was fun oh my god and then we went to this one place called the something pig something about a pig that's where we took the pictures and tagged them fucking Fuck, dude, they had this orange, uh, a blood orange wit. Oh, it just, it just, it just pass out. It was so good. It's a local beer, so I'm going to try and find it. I don't know how it's going to work out. Because on the way to San Francisco tomorrow, or today, really, because it was like two or something, I wanted to try to go by L.A. or look up and see if L.A., if I go through LA on the way back, because I have to get more fucking fans, dude. I need more red fans. I, oh my god. Just droning on and on. Crazy person. <sighs> Anyhow, well, I'm gonna go. I'm done with today. I'm excited for tomorrow. Why did you go go? Ow! <laughs> okay, okay.